Hello and welcome back to Song Reaction Analysis with your girl JVB. How are you guys doing today? First and foremost, thank you so much for being here on my channel, checking out my reactions as well as my own music and of course my dog. My dog Bolt is gracing us with his presence today. Oh, yes. So, we have a new reaction for you today. Felix Irvine. Irvine has been one of the channel's favorites and there's a lighter right here should i put the candles on and we love felix so much he's so talented and one of the requests you guys had was with or without you by you too and let me tell you something i love you too so much so yes i am game for this one um in case you don't know who I am yet, I'm a singer, songwriter, music producer and composer, vocal performance coach and I love doing reaction videos for you guys. And this is Bolt, my little superstar who's been with me all over the world, traveled with me and he is gonna let us know how he likes the song as well. Yes, right Bolt? Good. <laughs> so, I am playing a show in the Metaverse every Thursday by the way. Um, not everybody might be a fan, but you may want to check it out. I do live performances there. I'm also going to do some Twitch um, very soon, but that's kind of my first step. And I've been doing it for a while. I do a DJ residency um, in Decentraland. So if you're interested, definitely hit me up. I would love to have you there. And you don't necessarily need to have a wallet to be present. However, let's get to Felix and this amazing cover with or without you. So, let me get my headset set up first and um, then uh, make sure my mic works because that kind of needs to be, yeah, there we go. Mic is working, yes, wonderful. With no further ado guys, here it is, with or without you. See the sunset in your eyes. See the tone twist in your side. You know what's interesting? In the beginning, I didn't recognize it. And I like that because I was like, wait, this is a different with or without you? Okay, I want to hear it one more time. See the sunset in your eyes See the tone twist in your side I'll wait for you Set a fan and twist of fame On bed of nails she makes me wait And I wait Without you, with or without you, with or without you. The richness in his voice, no, 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 his chest voice, but it's not really a chest voice. It's a, it's his middle voice, but he's using the placement of his voice is so. Ah, oh, the vocal is just so clear and so rich and deep sounding, you know, like it's just, oh, it's so good. I really, really like that sound of his voice there. 
And then if you watch his mouth, let's go back to here. Just his, his enunciation is also extremely amazing. Really good job. Bed of nails, she makes me away. And I wait without you. Oh, all that. With or without you. With or without you Through the song we reach the shore You give it all but I want more And I'm waiting for you With or without you So relaxed Like when he opens his mouth, this openness and the sound is just so crystal clear and so domineering. It's I, that's the only way I can say it. It's just like so powerful and so awesome. Like it's just ah, such good control of his voice. And then I like his vibrato. And when he hits that high note, it's like board. It's like the belting sound, but without really like full force. You know, it's just still so relaxed sounding while he's really just like ah oh, just little like accents that he does the little color she adds to the vocal is just like so beautiful really really beautiful and it's it's such an amazing song he does a really good job of singing that song oh, I can And then when he goes right, give yourself a hands are tight. The way he transitions right back into the verse, like so seamless, so effortless, beautiful. It's just that that really harsh sound is like like that soft palate sound. It's just so good. Oh, oh, and I like how he had tra transitions. It's just like <laughs> so good. Give and you give yourself away. My body bruises got me with nothing to win and nothing left to lose and you gave yourself away and you gave yourself away and you so subtle right i just really really love how he has all this amazing 
transitions going on and then the li little colored sounds in his voice box it's just so beautiful the way he just ugh, does this rendition of this song which is like such an epic song and Bono is obviously such an amazing singer and the song is just such it's like an evergreen kind of song you know and the way he sings it I feel like it totally like fits his voice so well and he also really knows what to do and like I guess what not to do you know like he serves the song and when I say what not to do I don't even know what that means but I guess like not over singing not you know showing off he has obviously the ability to do that so let's go back to here sorry I had to like stop I hate stopping I know I know but I want to let it out like we'll, we'll just like listen till the end from here on okay Especially when he sings in a lower register, I just love that sound because it just sounds so full. It sounds so, you know, not everybody has a really um, powerful voice in the lower register because it's a bit more chest in the chest, right? But for me, in my opinion, I feel like he just like is able to project really strongly in that register, which is like pretty freaking amazing. And then when he transitions up to the high higher register it just like his belting sound his middle voice slightly going into his belt but not really he has a lot of control he has a great range and i also like how he adds like really subtle like a little bit of like vibrato into it a little bit of um this little rasp like but just like it's just like really just a tiny bit you know not overdoing it and i love that about him because that makes him so unique and i also feel that one of the many artists who like do covers he really picks the songs that so fit his voice and his range you know you always want to pick when you do cover songs you always want to pick songs that a resonate with you first first and foremost they have to resonate with you it has to be a song that you feel like man this i could have written a song because if you're just doing a song that you singing because you want to show off your range it just comes off as phony you know what i mean um unless you're really good at that <laughs> if you're really good at pretending and acting you know um because i know that's cover bands and some people don't like certain songs but they know that the audience really likes them um but with him i feel like he really picks the songs that a resonate with him and represent who he is as an artist and then also that really matches his like range or he makes it obviously plays guitar so you can make it any you know key he needs to be in to fit his voice um but i just love 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 his voice he's so well trained he has so much control over his voice and i also love the emotion he brings out in the song whenever he does a cover i haven't heard one yet where i felt like he hasn't quite like been in it you know so bravo felix mm -hmm. another one in the pocket and so the next one is going to be probably um, Shallow because you guys have been re recommending that as well. But man, I'm a big fan. I love his voice. And um, I forgot, I didn't see any comments about 
him doing his original music. So I'm going to ask one more time and I'm also going to do my own research, but I wonder if he actually has his own music as well, because I think he should. What do you guys think? In the comments below, let me know. Also, with that said, I want to leave you with something positive. As always, make every day a great day and know that everything will be just fine. There's so much craziness going on in the world right now. And in, in, in the day and time we live, it's sometimes really hard to know what is real and what's not because I feel we're being so deceived by the news. So I recommend get informed, but don't spend too much time watching the news because it can really mess with you, fuck with your mind and like make you worried so much that you forget to be in the now and to forget to live your life. And being informed is important. Obviously, we want to know what's going on in the world. We want to know what's going on in the markets, especially I have if, if, you know, if it directly affects your finances or your well-being, whatever. Um, I get that. But like I said, don't and do uh, do your research on things, you know, like talk to maybe people that are in that country or like that are in that business are in that field to really get some second, third opinions on what's going on and more like a real time real life um more normal people with no agendas um talking about what's going on so I, that's my recommendation um because in the chaotic world i also feel there's like renaissance um happening where revolution happening where we we you know shifting from the old way, way to into a new way and it's up to us on how we do it and how we handle it with this whole situation and always come from a place of love because there's a saying kill them with kindness and that is so true because when you come from a place of love you first of all put love energy out into the universe which is super important versus like putting more chaotic energy and more stress energy out there and more hatred and more fear you know instead just like be courageous and know that you know what we've gone through a lot humanity has gone through a lot the the planet has gone through a lot and we've survived it all so far so i'm sure whatever is happening right now we will make it through but we have to try our best to stay positive and in the light with that said i'm gonna let you go and i will see you in the next one make sure that you hit the like button subscribe button notification bell so you'll never miss a post of mine and also check out my music i have a new drop coming very soon so join me on twitter and also join my newsletter in the comments below and if you want to if if you feel like it I now have a PO box 777 and feel free to send me something. Yeah, I'm receptive to all the good that's coming my way. Love you so much and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.